Cardona's journey from the humble streets of Venice to global stardom is a narrative filled with dazzling skill and indomitable spirit. But how did this young boy from Venus Aires captivate the world and lead his nation to World Cup glory? Venture into the life of Maradona, where football meets passion and legend. Early life and youth career Diego Maradona's story began on October 1396 in Venus, Venice, Aires. From a young age, his love for football was evident. At three, he received his first football and by eight, his talent was spotted by scout Francisco Cornejo while playing for a local club Trello Rojo. Cornejo introduced him to the youth team of Argentina's juniors, where his exceptional skills quickly made him a standout player. Growing up, Maradona idolized George Best and Roberto Rivellino and their playing styles might have left an impression on the young stars. His knack for football was undeniable and the buzz around him grew. Professional Career Diego Maradona's club career is a captivating narrative of a young Argentine talent to sent to global stardom. It all comments in the heartland of Argentine football at Argentina's juniors, where a young Maradona mesmerized the crowds with 116 goals in 66 appearances. His prodigious talent swiftly caught the eye of the powerhouse Boca Juniors, where he moved in 1981. In the blue and yellow, Maradona continued his football poetry, netting 28 goals in 40 appearances, further etching his name in hearts of the Argentine public. However, you beckoned and Maradona asked to call by joining Barcelona in 1982. Amidst the architectural beauty of Catalonia, Maradona displayed his artistry on the field with 22 goals in 36 appearances. Yet, the apex of Maradona's club career was destined to be in the vibrant city of Naples. In 1984, Maradona arrived at Napoli, a club craving success. His tenure at Napoli was nothing short of legendary. He guided the club to numerous accolades. With his dazzling footwork and ingenious play, scoring 81 goals in 188 appearances. The sunset on Maradona's golden days at Napoli after a brief sojourn at Sevilla where he made 26 appearances and scored 5 goals, he turned to his homeland. A short spell at Newell's Old Boys with 5 appearances was followed by a nostalgic return to Boca Juniors, where he made 30 appearances and scored 7 goals, allowing the Argentine maestro one last dance in domestic arena he cherished. National Career Diego Maradona's national career with Argentina is as illustrious as his club career. Marked by his impeccable skill and indomitable spirit on the field, his journey with the Argentine national team began early, representing Argentina in the U20 team between 1977 and 1979. Here, English scored 8 goals in 15 appearances. However, the pinnacle of Maradona's international career came during the 1986 World Cup held in Mexico. Under his captaincy, Argentina clinched the World Cup title with Maradona playing central role. His performances were nothing short of legendary, scoring 5 goals and assisting 5 more. Among the most memorable moments of that tournament and indeed Maradona's career was the hand of God Gold and his incredible solo run against England in the quarterfinals, which showcased his dribbling prowess and goal scoring ability. Maradona's international career spanned from 1977 to 1994 making 91 appearances and scoring 34 goals for the senior national team. 
He also represented Argentina in four FIFA World Cup tournaments, with the 96 tournament being the highlight of his international career. His captaincy in the 96 World Cup etched his name in football history, embodying the Argentine spirit and showcasing a blend of skill and determination. Retirement and later years After an illustrious playing career, Diego Maradona transitioned into various roles within football, including managerial positions. He became the head coach of the Argentine national football team in November 2008, leading the team during the 2010 World Cup held in South Africa. Although his tenure in the post-tournament, Maradona's coaching journey continued in Middle East with Dubai-based club Alvas during the 2011-2012 season. His next venture led him to Fujairah in 2017, although he departed at the season's conclusion. In a surprising turn, Maradona embraced a new challenge as a chairman of the Russian club Dynamo Press in May 2018, beginning his duties in July of the same year. His managerial pursuit led him back to the field as a coach of Mexican club Dorados from September 2018 to June 2019. In the final chapter of his football journey, Maradona returned to Argentina to manage Primera Division club Gimnasio de la Plata from September 2019 until his passing in 2021. Maradona's post-retirement era also saw him venturing into television. He had a show called La Noche del Ten aired in 2005 where he hosted various celebrities including Pelé and showcased his personal and professional life. The show also had a segment where Maradona played football with his guests or performed tricks. His later years were also marked by health issues, which were often in the public eye, including his struggles with obesity and alcohol. His passing on November 25, 2020 led to a global outpour of grief, marking the end of an era for football and its fans alike. Controversies Drug abuse Maradona struggled with drug addiction for a significant part of his life. His cocaine use started around the time he was playing in Spain and continued during his time in Italy. Notably, he was suspended from football for 15 months in 1991 after testing positive for cocaine. Illegal activities and association Maradona faced scandals involving an illegitimate son and rumors of his association with the Camorra, an Italian criminal organization, during his time in Italy. Violent behavior In 1992, Maradona was arrested in Argentina for shooting a journalist with an air rifle. Additionally, during his time with Barcelona, he was involved in a club during a game against Athletic Bilbao which resulted in a mass brawl and 60 injured individuals, leading to disputes with the Barcelona executives and his transfer to Napoli. Doping Maradona was exposed from the 1994 FIFA World Cup after failing a doping test, marking another significant controversy in his career. Personal life Family Maradona married Claudio Villafania in 1984, but they divorced in 2004. They had two daughters, Delman Hira and Giannina Dinora. Besides, he had a son, Diego Sinopra, from an extramarital affair during his time in Napoli. Political belief Maradona's influence transcend beyond the pitch, impacting politics and popular culture in Argentina and globally. His outspoken nature often landed him in the heart of political discussions, advocating for leftist ideologies and supporting leaders like Fidel Castro and Hugo Chavez. 